Okay, so today is the third day of rehearsals. Today we had some text work to do and then we finally went to the theater, like the university theater, to practice our lines and just block some of the things we will be doing. The first day was just kind of getting to know each other, our names and stuff like that. And then the second day we started with text work. And then today we finished our text work that we started last week and then so many and thens <laughs> but uh, today we just kind of worked on what the play will look like the life of the play or I don't know how they call it the world of the play yeah, yeah, yeah. the world of the play so that was what we walked on worked on today and I guess what I've really been realizing <laughs> realizing things is that I tend to speak like softly as opposed to projecting my voice it's not that I don't know how to project my voice but I just have a tendency to like not want to speak loud it's not even about speaking loud it's just about projecting so that's definitely something I need to work on and then the second thing that I learned today was the importance of punctuation so the meanings of commas and dashes and semicolons and colons and all that stuff so that was really cool for me to be able to get to know something different than what was being taught in like primary school or like junior high and whatnot so that's been pretty nice and I have another rehearsal tomorrow so that will be like the it's yeah I guess the fourth rehearsal so we'll see what happens tomorrow I think tomorrow I might have to get up on stage and do some narrating but that's pretty much it for today so yeah I'll see you guys tomorrow and then I'll try to document like before rehearsals and then after rehearsals and then I'll put all of these together and see where it goes but yeah that's pretty much it see ya so I can't really keep track of what day it is I think it's the fourth day and today we basically went through some other scenes i did my scene like one of my scenes today and we kind of went over it one thing i realized again is that i am running out of breath talking my way across the stage so what i'm going to do is continue practicing breathing throughout the whole line it was really cool to see what the staging looks like and i think it's coming together it looks really good so far i wish i could like show what it looks like so far but i don't think i'm allowed to do that so i'm not gonna do that I'm, it's been like really good so far i'm just i'm really excited to see how this is going to turn out in regards to my lines i'm pretty much almost memorized for my lines in the play so that's really exciting added another part where we get to do some things on stage it's just i'm so excited i can't i can't wait for opening night and the run of the show and for everybody to see what we've been working on even though it's only like the fourth day but it just feels like it's been coming along so well also peep this lighting oh my, i wish i had this lighting at home to do my makeup and stuff I'm done for the day and i get to go home early today i have a midterm tomorrow so i have to go home and kind of i've studied for it i just have to wrap it up but that's pretty much it i'll catch you tomorrow we have rehearsals tomorrow from 6 to 10 and we're going to be working through some other scenes so I'll tell you how it goes. In the meantime, I'm going to be working on projection and breathing. Yep. So today is day number five. I had some scenes that I had to do and it was fun. Still figuring out where I need to be, who I am. I'm so tired. I need to go journal all of this stuff down so I don't forget about it, but yeah, it's coming along. Well, yeah, that's all I can think about. Like, there's just so much staging going on that it's making it hard for me to like decide where I want to be. But I'm not afraid, I think. <laughs> I'm not afraid. But I think it's all going to get sorted out. I feel like this video is so mumble jumbled. I'm just really tired. I had a midterm today, so I'm gonna go sleep. Bye. So today is the 21st of October, and um, it's a Sunday. Sat it's a Saturday, and we just had rehearsals. Ugh. 
I'm so I feel so oh, like I feel like I'm not trying to say the wrong words but I don't know I feel like I'm not talking loud enough like I feel like I've said this in every single video but that's those are the notes I've been getting back and I also feel like I can't talk loud because the past couple of days I got a new pair of contacts so I think they're giving me a headache so if I talk too loud like it actually just pronounces my headache so I've been kind of trying to I don't even know why I'm crying I'm not even upset so like I don't know if I'm just being like super hard on myself, but I actually feel like shit. Like I, I hate feeling like I'm doing something wrong. <laughs> That's it. That's it. I'm done. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna dwell on this. I'll just forgive myself and try to do better on the next. We have tomorrow off, so Monday we have rehearsals <sighs> yeah I'm ready for Monday like uh, yeah Monday's gonna be a good day even though I feel like shit right now we'll see yeah so that's it I'm not the kind of person to take anything personally like I know that all of this training is for my own good acting is not easy it's not supposed to be easy anyway so I'm actually really happy that I'm getting a good experience like I'm getting trained to be a good actor but I really really appreciate that like I'm I know for a fact like without a doubt like this is this this has nothing to like do with like hurting my feelings but this is just to make me a better actor so I'm not I'm like I'm not mad I'm not sad I just I feel like I'm almost disappointed in myself but that that's just because I'm like I'm always hard on myself to do things the right way to be really good at doing something like I don't want to be someone who's like half-assing things and uh, tomorrow I'm gonna spend time kind of just yelling at my mom at home and yelling in terms of saying my lines out loud and then Monday I'm gonna bring it like I'm fucking ready like y'all are not ready to hear me on Monday I feel like Monday is gonna be a good day because I'm going to take this positive criticism and um, sculpt it to make me better like I'm sure for a fact like this is gonna make me better so I'm done tripping I'm not tripping anymore I was touched but now I'm untouched so I don't know what day it is today um, <laughs> Like, in terms of rehearsals, today is the 17th of October, I believe. Um, and I'm actually on my way to rehearsals today. We're doing some movement things. And I've been... <laughs> I've been exhausted the past two rehearsals. I feel like they've been such a push for me. Um, I just feel like I'm not getting as much rest I should as I should be getting. It's not like I'm wasting my time or anything like that when I'm not in school but I'm taking three classes and even that is still like hard for me to balance at least I'm not getting sick I've actually been taking so many like medications to make me not sick like vitamin C so that's been helping a lot but other than that today's actually been a really good day because I finished early I came home right after my classes and I took a nap because I'm like, you know what, usually when I'm done school, I go to the library and I study for five hours and then go to rehearsals. But today I was like, no, my body needs to rest. I'm getting really tired. And instead of drinking coffee every single day and drinking like two cups of coffee every single day, like my body needs to rest. I came home and I just, I just slept. So I didn't get any reading done today, but that's okay because getting rest <laughs> is more important to than doing any readings I finished my essay that's actually due tomorrow so I'm on a good track I'm really excited to go to tonight's rehearsal I'm just gonna grab coffee and then head out I don't need coffee but I'm just kind of craving it because I like the smell and the taste of coffee now four years of university and you sure 
be liking coffee if you're me the place coming along really well there's been so many movement sequences added to it so many things for my character to do um the the role where i'm actually moving and skipping and stuff we've kind of changed it from skipping into me just sitting down and adoring the flowers and everything like that because skipping kind of got a little exhausting for me like i can keep up with it no problem but if there was something else for me to do as a character to make my role more dynamic then i would take that any day over like skipping continuously in a circle so that's been kind of working out well and my hair oh my god i actually prefer leaving my hair out to like getting it done i don't like getting my hair done anyway so this has been a great opportunity for me to try to grow my hair out my face is kind of breaking out but i also think it's because i'm not getting enough sleep and enough rest i think it's just not enough rest i'm getting enough sleep not enough rest like i'm not resting enough like I, i'm sleeping because i have to sleep and because i have school the next day but i'm not sleeping like to enjoy sleep and to like nap because I'm the kind of person like I nap at least once a day and then I sleep and I always have to have that because that's what works for me so the fact that I haven't been able to like insert that little nap has actually just been messing with my body I'm, I'm healthy I'm happy and I'm so excited to be in this play I'm super stoked that's pretty much everything I have today sorry I haven't been keeping up with these recordings and kind of checking in that's everything thank you for watching and i'll see you in my next video which i, I don't know when it's gonna be <laughs> i don't want to keep promises because i finish at 10 30 at night and it's so hard for me to make a video it's dark out so we'll see anyways bye <laughs>
I, I think I don't have rehearsal till six today, but I'm going to be there at five because I need to like work through my blocking, practice all the things that I need to know before rehearsal starts today. So, and I also need to figure out like the arrangement of my flip flops because we have to wear flip flops for the play because it's in a pool which is super cool so I need to figure out where my flip <laughs> flip flops go because I keep well I stopped walking like backstage because I stepped on a splinter right as I was about to go on stage so that taught me a very good lesson so I need to figure out how my flip flops work why can't I say the word flip flops yeah that's pretty much everything I have to say I will see you after class morning guys I am having the craziest day today um, I have class right now and I just missed my bus which is great I mean I wouldn't have made the bus anyway because it was just passing and I just got here in part so I had to pick up something um, my parcel that I was talking about is at the back finally picked it up so I have to open that put my laptop in it I had class at 9 30 it's 9 44 9 41 but this is my first time being late to that class so I think I get a pass um, I also so I I was on time and everything and then I forgot my food at home and I did not take a nap yesterday because I was making this food so I was like no 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 I'm gonna drive home get my food and then go to school so that's why I'm late but anyways, I'll see you guys later. And then I can like show you the case. It's just like a simple marble case. I've had a mar marble case before and mine was broken. And then I have rehearsals tonight from 6 to 10. Going to go to the gym at 2.30 I believe. But yeah, I'm kind of liking this makeup too. I don't know why I'm chilly. Uh, it's because my next bus isn't till the next like 10-15 minutes. <laughs> I'm just like super late for this class. I don't even know why I'm going at this point, but I'm not a skipper It's better late than never so I'm gonna I'm be there. I mean at this point It's just so embarrassing to walk into class this late. It's 9 50 and I still have 10 minutes to walk I'm just not gonna go I'm gonna go to the library study this class there are PowerPoint slides and there are also there's also a textbook so I'm just gonna do that as opposed to like walking in and like embarrassing myself. So yeah. Alright, so it's currently 4.34 in the afternoon. I actually made it to my class this morning. I went, I was only there for like 45 minutes though, so it was better than not going at all. I'm having another coffee right now because I have to take pictures for our promo shoot for my school play at five. I'm gonna walk across and get uh, okay so the person in front of me is like backing his car back because he probably thinks I'm like taking a video of him on his <laughs> I'm taking a video of myself uh, I'm sorry but I'm gonna go get dressed and then get ready for this promo shoot I don't know what it's going to be about so that's gonna be great and that's pretty much that's pretty much it. Oh, I don't want to get out because it's so cold outside. It's so warm in my car, but I gotta go. Okay, anyways, I'll see you guys after rehearsals because I have rehearsals. So I have the promo shoot from 5 to 6. I have rehearsals from 6 to 10. So I'll see you after rehearsals. Okay, so I just got home and my glasses actually came in the mail. I, I just ordered these babies. Oh, that's cool. Two, like two days them to come which is super nice but yeah I'm just gonna go to bed right now today at rehearsal was pretty good um, we didn't we did some transition stuff and just and then we went out for drinks after it did not have a single drink because yo I'm trying to keep my body looking right like <laughs> I'm about to be putting some toxins into this snack of a body just kidding I want to be snacked though but yeah, I just, just not my jam. But yeah, I still had a great time. I can have a good time even if I don't drink, so it's, it's whatever. But yeah, I'm gonna go to bed and I'll see you guys tomorrow. It's Friday and I don't have class tomorrow, but I do have rehearsals from 9 to 5 tomorrow. So I'm gonna be at school and I have to be at the gym tomorrow at 6. Well, I have to be out of the house by 6.15, so it's gonna be a great day.
night see you morning yesterday was opening night and it was amazing we had so many people come to see the show it runs from november 24th to december 2nd and man like i that was a surreal experience it was so good i felt so good about like everything that happened yesterday the vibes were just so good right off the bats like in the evening when everybody was coming into the dressing room everyone was so happy so excited so it was it was amazing we had such a good time like i'm pretty sure like everybody had a good time and then we went out for the after party like after the show was done and i didn't drink and then i went to my friend's house and then i had a drink and i was like no drinking and driving so i did not drive home yesterday i slept at my friend's house and then drove home drove myself home this morning um it was really fun though it was nothing like i honestly what i liked was the fact that it was like nothing wild like it wasn't like some crazy like party super chill like everybody was just having a good time dancing vibing i can kind of see how people get addicted to this feeling because it's just a, like such a good feeling and then my mom decided she was gonna get me a martini and some flowers i actually love my mother though she, <laughs> she's like time to get lit and then she got me a bunch of flowers so i just drank this martini this morning it's like 10 49 in the mor morning and i'm like yeah the first thing i'm gonna do is drink my martini because i just i was trying not to like eat unhealthy or like drink unhealthy because of this dress that i'm wearing let me show y'all it just looks like this yeah so the fact that i was like wearing this dress i was like super careful with what i was eating the whole week before the show so now i feel like i can let loose a little drink a little martini i'm i'm really excited to continue to like work and figure out things about my character the thing that was really funny to me though yesterday was um i was acting like as my character for like the flower girl and i was just feeling her so hard I was like, oh, this character is so relatable. I was able to relate to the character beforehand. There are certain words in that character that was like, oh yeah, I, I see. I, I like, I kind of, I, I, I can relate with her. But yesterday, oh, that was such a different feeling. Like, even there was one part in the show, like Arpheus and Eurydice, and that scene when he like screams, like, no, uh, it was just. I felt like I was gonna cry, like collecting the bridal gown from her like i'm usually like sad like well you can't like conjure emotion because that's bad acting i just felt like i was so invested in the story that i actually was going to cry and i put my mask on i didn't forget any like yesterday was so good i didn't forget my cues my like everything was like da da that's the way i've always wanted to do it so it was like yes i'll let you guys know how the rest of the things go i know i wasn't filming in between all this craziness that was going on but that's just because um it's just been so crazy like every time i'm done at like 10 o'clock i come home and i'm like <sighs> I'm, I'm out and i can't make vlogs in the morning because i have class at 9 30 and every single time i try to make vlogs in the morning before i go to class that one time that i tried i was actually just late i would just try to put things in wherever i can and we'll see i hope you guys love these because your girl's enjoying them. But anyways, I'm gonna go sleep again. I need to do some house chores. And man, yeah. I'll see you guys maybe tonight. Maybe in a couple of days. We'll see how it goes. Bye. Okay, so we had our third run tonight. And actually, it was a matinee. So this afternoon. And so everybody came. This is when the din came. And all our profs. And pretty much like all the important people came. So we had such a good run Ugh. i just every single day i'm just like super excited damn i sound i i really sound corny but like today the energy was so great and then before we went to perform we all have this like warm-ups that we do as a group i honestly like those group warm-ups because it like hypes up the energy so everyone has like super high energy before we go on the stage so that happened and then um we had like a reception and everyone just had mimosas 
every single time we do this sh show, I feel like I get more and more comfortable doing it. And I think it's because during the show, like we get to do like the whole entire show as opposed to during rehearsals. Sometimes we just work bits and pieces of like different parts of the show. But during the actual show, every single night you get to do like what you're supposed to do in the show, right? So every night I've been like getting way more comfortable playing these distinct characters and just like having such a good time playing that. But I'm really happy with the turnout today. The whole theater was like packed, which honestly is great energy. There's so many people. I'm so happy people came in to see it. And then apparently like there's there are people who really liked our show and some people are like promoting it on their Instagram, which is great for us because then more people come in to see the show and enjoy what we get to do every single night. every single night I come on and I'm like ah this is so great so um yeah I don't know I'm so excited because it's such a good feeling when you put your heart into something and you just enjoy it but yeah I'm home now I'm just gonna eat do some studying and then go to bed because I have work at 12 tomorrow so and tomorrow we're off so I get to like rest my voice rest well I'm not resting since I'm going to work but I still kind of get to rest and not be at school so that's kind of nice okay so I just finished my warm-up one more night before we close the show but yeah I'm super excited I'm gonna go into the dressing room and kind of get ready get dressed but this is my second last warm up before the show closes. So I'm super excited about that. I've been warming up every single day before the show and I think it has really been helping me um, with my voice. With my voice. I'm being so weird, but I'm really excited. Yeah. So I'm just currently walking in for my last show. I'm about to go get ready, warm up and it's going to be so good tonight because it's the last night. I kind of see someone who I know coming, but that's okay. Hashtag why is the door locked? <sighs> okay, so I'm in the dressing room for the last time. I can't believe this is happening. So usually what I do is I take off my glasses, put in my contacts, get my eyebrows done. We don't really wear makeup for the show, so the only makeup we wear is mascara and eyeliner and highlighter. So those are the three things I'm going to do today. And then I'll go do my physical and vocal warm-ups, fight call, and then change into my first outfit, which is being a narrator. So I'm super excited for tonight. It's the last night. I'm so happy because I need to sleep, but I'm also sad because the show's ending. I'm getting a warm up right now. Too.
Peter Jumbo 